Hello everyone, my name is Vaibhav and I'm the founder of I'm Skills. I will be your coach today in this digital marketing orientation class at I'm Skills. Before we guys begin, uh, hi to Anup, Anushka, Bhaskar, Darshan, Kanchan, Pranay. We have Shubham, we have Ankit here and then Ashwini is also joining. Guys in the chat box where I'm writing hi to everybody, if you can just confirm that you guys can hear my voice and the screen is also clear to everybody. And then we can begin with the orientation. Thank you, Bhaskar. Thank you, Anushka, Ashwini. Let's quickly create the agenda for the class today. I'm going to discuss about digital marketing industry overview. Now, I will not give you an overview around what is SEO, what is social media. I will help you to understand how people use digital marketing or based on their businesses, how people plan their digital marketing journey or their strategies. On the other side, I will go ahead and put some light that is on revenue resources, how one can go ahead and develop those. What are the ways people make money through digital marketing? And we will get in depth of it, not just an overview. Then I'll give you the long term vision around digital marketing, because one myth which absolutely everybody is spreading and at the same time people develop is that a short course for three months and six months is like you are going to become a pro in this subject it is absolutely not true how much time it takes for you to learn digital marketing properly and, uh, and in fact to become someone not even a pro i'll put some light on that subject too then i'll give you an overview of what we guys do at iron skills why is that we are one of the most respected institution delivering content programs digital programs and we will talk about our course. Then I'll give you an opportunity to go ahead and ask questions around your career, about our course or anything, right? So let's begin. But before we guys begin, I would like to congratulate everybody, those who are planning to take their career towards digital side. I think uh, directionally you are uh, absolutely right. Reason being post COVID-19, if you look at, I mean this pandemic since March, especially, a lot of opportunities around the digital is emerging, right? Everywhere you might have seen digital jobs are increasing. LinkedIn have declared that digital was the only job that has caused the maximum post around LinkedIn job posting as well. Why is that so? Because if you look at it as a number of people, those who are planning to take their businesses online, they are increasing rapidly. If you look at the number every millisecond, we have around four to five new websites which are going live at the search engines like Google, Bing, Yahoo. Now, what happens is that right, I would need someone to take care of my digital marketing work as well, to manage my social media, to manage my SEO, to manage my content, to manage my video marketing, correct? Now, there is either one way that I will go ahead and hire someone as a full-time employee. So that's an opportunity for those who are looking forward to go ahead and get the job. Then I will look forward that there are people who can do this free on freelance basis or agency. I will go ahead and outsource or look forward to go ahead and give my work to. So from all the context, if you look at digital is growing and there is no doubt that this industry is not going anywhere and this will definitely grow further. So as a direction, you guys are absolutely right. I think you're moving towards the right trend. However, there are a few things which you need to understand and I will try to give you maximum understanding in this orientation class today. All right. Now let's understand. <clears throat> now what is digital? Now if I'll ask you guys a question today, everybody will say because you have read it at the internet and institute uh, or their websites that digital is social media marketing. Digital is planning and advertising at the internet. That includes Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, right? This is what you will say or answer that digital marketing is marketing products through a digital assets which are available at the internet at various resources, correct? But that's not the thin line. The thin line is digital is all available in four different forms. Text, voice, infographics, and videos. Now, when I talk about these four platforms, I will give you guys one example so that you can relate it better. So let's say, if you look at Amazon as a brand, in the end of the day, what Amazon expect? Are they looking forward to advertise or they're looking forward to finally sell the products which are there at their website? It's a question to everybody in the chat box if you guys can write. What is the final objective for an e-commerce based business company? Any, any e-commerce based, not just Amazon. 
in the chat box from all that is to self right Bhaskar? right ashwini and everyone else now let's go ahead and take this as an example so let's say there is one product uh, let's name this iphone 11 all right let's google this now iphone 11 within india people search for close to around one second 1.5 million search volume right out of which 5 lakh people they click at seo based research rest 2 lakh uh, 50 thousand people they click at non i mean paid results ads this is indian market let's also check us market let's check now us the market for iphone 11 now it's like 1 million us all right let me go back to india so that my next searches can be performed from india only now let me help you guys to understand so 1.5 million people they search for a product called iphone 11 and amazon is appeared here right now if you broadly look at let me show you guys this thing in the incognito because because of this tool sometime we get different results here we go now this is ad all right and then we have apple gsm arena and amazon now if you look at it this is infographics it's a shopping ad based on infographic right now 2.5 lakh people every month they definitely click at ad results for amazon it is a possibility right to sell through ads like mean infographics at the search engines right Similarly, for SEO based result, which is text based, it's content based, right? They are available here at this platform too. Now, out of these two volume searches, they are available at both the places, ads and SEO based results. Higher number of chances to sell. Am I right? Now, in this case, if you broadly look at what if Amazon will invest their money at social media marketing or invest their money at video marketing for this product? Do you think they are going to make profit out of it? Do people search it for video based ads for Amazon or any anyone actually go ahead and search at YouTube to buy iPhone 11? No. Able to relate guys what I'm trying to say? The point is based on my businesses or the objectives I am looking forward to fulfill, I would need to go ahead and use these channels. Getting my point? So in this case, though text-based advertisement is available at social media, video-based advertisement is available at other channels, but it is irrelevant. So based on businesses, internet is available and every channel offers you text, voice, infographics-based, video-based advertisement platforms. However, based on our target audiences, we need to go ahead and pick those channels and then we are going to further use those channels. Is this correct? Is this okay for everybody? Is this clear? Can I get a quick yes, no, maybe? So if next time someone asks you that, what is digital marketing? Don't give this random answer that it is social media. This is SEO. This is email marketing. No, 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 not at all. Let's so ask people, what is your objective? Then identify what people search. Where are their target audiences, right? And then you can go ahead and explore those opportunities. This is one of the way that you can go ahead and make a difference that you are better in terms of understanding about this subject. Now, the next thing which we are going to talk about is how to go ahead and achieve our objectives. But our objectives, when we say that is you guys, okay? Those who are spending their minutes with me in this orientation class, I'm here to guide you and coach you guys about how can you go ahead and get your first job, how you can go ahead and start with freelancing, how can you go ahead and set up your digital based businesses, or even if you have an existing traditional based business, you're looking forward to take it online. I am going to guide you guys how. Whether you learn it from us or anywhere else, you should know how to go ahead and achieve. All right. So we will put some light and I will also help you to understand how to get a breakthrough at a good salary. Because if you look at it, digital is next IT sector that a lot of people are pursuing these courses. And then in the end of the day, only smart people will get good packages and rest are all at struggling at 10,000, 15,000 salary. So I'll help you guys to understand how to get a breakthrough of that 40, 50K salary, how you're going to make that profile for yourself. 
But before I do that, in the chat box, I want people to contribute and write that I'm here to achieve a job. I am here to set up my freelance or I am here to go ahead and establish my own business. In the chat box, a contribution required from all to name a few, Anket, Anup, Anushka, Apoor, Ashwini, Bhaskar, Darshan, Harsh, Isha, Jan, Kanchan, Gupta, if I'm not wrong, Pranay, Rohit, Shubham, Yashmin, and then Ijafi, Alex. So we have Bhaskar for a job freelance, Harsh for freelance, Anushka to get a job, Prane, I'm here to achieve a job, Anu for freelance, Shubham freelance, and Ashwini to start with freelance and eventually set up a business. Apoor for freelancing, Yashmin again for freelancing, maybe build a new brand for Apoor, wonderful. Kanchan to get a job. I'm, ho I'm here to scale up my career and personal website as well. This is for Ankit Verma, very good. Anyone else who would like to contribute? or is still contributing. All right, so let me go ahead and pick these subjects one by one and I'll go ahead and put some light. Now let's understand the job point of view. So first we will talk about what people expect from you guys so that you can finally go ahead and become an asset versus a liability. See, there are two ways to get a job. First way, so see, I we are known about one thing that is called we are honest. We are very blunt, to be honest. We never hide anything. All right. That's our beauty. So let me tell you guys one thing very clearly. If you guys have a certification from Google, Facebook, HubSpot, you're not going to get a job. Just remember this thing. And I'm telling you being an owner of an institute, no one hires your certifications anymore in the internet industry, especially. People are only going to hire a skilled professional. Now, what I am trying to tell, I'm going to create this in this orientation class. What is digital marketing job profiles? Let's understand. Someone may hire you as a Google ad specialist. All right. Someone may hire you for a content writing profile example, which is partially SEO. Okay. Then someone may hire you. That is for let's say Facebook or social media advertisement guy, all right, Facebook ad specialist. Now, if you broadly look at digital can only be done in two ways. One is organic, one is paid marketing. Please pay attention to this guys. Organic stands for without spending any money at the internet, you are going to use various channels to advertise your services. Now, this is very slow process. Organic is slow process. It takes around, depending upon your website's age, three months to six months time. And are results guaranteed? No, there is no guarantee about the result. Is this clear? Everybody? The second process is paid marketing. This is very quick. I mean, you start with the website today. Tomorrow, you can start capturing leads, sales and everything. But for this, Google ask you or every channel ask you for money. How much money? Huge. If your ticket size is big, definitely you can advertise aggressively like every other place. In this case, are results guaranteed? Yes. Answer is yes. Why? But I'm not saying that you will get a breakthrough. If you're investing one rupee, you will earn one rupee. That's not the true. But yes, you will definitely get sales, leads, whatever you're looking at. Is this point clear to everybody so far until here? Quick yes from all in the chat box. There are two ways. One is organic, other one is paid. Great. Now let's understand. Let's talk about you guys. Let's assume that you're applying for a job and you've done a certification from IM skills and you are moving to Amazon and you're saying that, okay, I'll go ahead and join your team of digital marketing and I'm good at advertisement. All right. So you will either pick your profile for organic or paid. I'll, I'll put some light on this. First, understand this part. So you are saying that I'll go ahead and take care of your new brand. Let's say iPhone 12. Now, Amazon is like they're advertising for one crore rupees a month and they will look forward that person should go ahead and get them a sale of 10 CR. 10X of what they, you know, spend on their marketing, right? Now, you are someone who will say that in the interview that, hey, recruiter, I've done a course and I am certified with Google, Facebook, HubSpot. This is one option. 
and then there is second candidate so let's name these two candidates the first candidate name is webhav all right the second candidate name is kanchan gupta all right now let's say kanchan is the second candidate she says that i've been doing digital marketing six last six months all right and i do not have any kind of a certifications with me though i am very uh, good with paid advertisement in the past what i've done i was running a campaign around let's say uh, she has a blog around let's say car racing all right and uh, i was able to get 1 lakh subscribers to my blog my funnel has a conversion percentage of 10% and i only sell a small ticket for let's say 1000 rupees ebook 1k ebook these these are to the car racing enthusiast now according to you guys the recruiter will hire who the one who is certified or this second person kanchan who has skills with her according to you guys now people will definitely hire the second professional why because i am not going to bet my 1 crore rupees for someone who will take let's say 30k as a salary and then will try with my money i in the end of the day need someone who has experience am i right all of you are fresher you have done a course and every institute will tell you that we will give you an internship will they give you money to spend at google ads answer is no they won't will i give you my money to spend at the advertisement no can you go ahead and run some campaigns it's a difficult process but a long process too getting my point everybody how will i get a breakthrough how will i get a job is this critical everyone needs answer around it quick yes no maybe and before that i want to know was this clear to everybody why kanchan will be hired versus a student who has just done an iim skills course am i making sense here and because everyone each one of you is in a trap remember one thing you guys are in trap right now you are in one marketing thing wherever you are checking nowadays including google is showing you uh, go go you know career of digital all such things why because people are targeting you every second through an email through ads and also just come out of it because this kind of a transparent conversation especially in our orientation where people are likely to buy people won't do so you have to accept the fact but the point is no one will go ahead and give you their even 1 lakh rupee to test whether you are a good person or you are a bad person in internet industry now i'm sure everybody is interested to understand how will i get a breakthrough that is to get good salary a scalable career at a good organization where i'm actually learning along with that it's a good brand so here is what you guys have to go ahead and follow see guys until class 10 you guys have learned uh let's say all these subjects english hindi science math social science uh, maybe rest of the other subjects too then in 11 what happened you realized that i am here to or i'm good at let's say arts i'm good at good at let's say commerce with maths without maths right and then i am good at science with bio without bio do you remember this now this helped you to overall develop your profile accordingly wherever you are with your careers today your until class 10 you have developed that base and then 11th onwards you finally decided that entire journey am i correct now this is what digital marketing is first myth which people have in their mind is that i will do everything guys first remember you can either become an organic marketer or you can become a paid marketer so you need to decide while you are learning digital marketing anywhere that which area i will pick up organic or paid remember this is only for those who are getting into a job not for those who are about freelancing once you are an organic marketer or a paid marketer you have defined that part you must know the channels you are going to explore can be seo can be content and can be youtube marketing again organically and email marketing too all right now these channels these four channels can help you to go ahead in depth of it and if it is ads learn about all types of ad funnels and all such things these are jargons around internet industry now once you are going to develop your strong profile you must set up your portfolio and why i'm saying this because doing everything it is impossible as a person as your potential you cannot write 3000 words of a content in a day 
and then you cannot go ahead and do a SEO of that particular website. And then you cannot go ahead and take care of email marketing, Google ads, social media ads and all. Almost impossible that part. Now, once this part is clear, what you guys have to go ahead and do, that's more important. Now you have to go ahead and decide that you are an asset. How can you become an asset? I'm going to put some light. So until here, once you've decided that I am an organic marketer or a paid marketer, decide your journey. Which type of an organization I would like to go ahead and join? Let's say Kanchan is there and she says that I am in Delhi and I cannot move out of Delhi and I will join a digital marketing agency. That too, in Delhi only. This is her focus. Or let's say a travel agency or any, any let's say banking or financial institutions. Getting my point? Now decide what these guys want in the end of the day. If you are at a you know, digital marketing agency, you're applying for a job, there can be two executions you are responsible to do. Pay attention. It can be one that you will serve the clients. Now, when I say serve the clients, they will get people on board. You will do their requirements of social media marketing, email marketing, all such things. Am I right? Can I say yes on this? This is point one, right? You will either serve to these guys. Quick yes, no in the chat box. The second requirement is they will hire you for their own objectives. Now for a brand, let's say an agency, what is the final objective? Let's say when it is, it was Amazon, what Amazon wants online sales, right? Amazon wants online sales. If it is an agency, what they do? They don't sell online, they do lead generation through internet. That people like you, like we generated a lead, right? We are into B2C, we will generate a lead and then my team members will speak with you and then we will sell you based on our process, correct? So for agency, this is for lead generation. So if you are hired for their internal role, what, will you, what are you responsible to or your responsibilities? Your responsibilities are lead generation. Now, lead generation can be done through uh, social media can be done through SEO, can be done through email or any such channels, correct? Now, if it is this, you need to prove that you are good at it, point one. And if it is this, they want you to be an asset. Asset who can assure that you can capture leads. So what you should do, the point. The point of view is, let's assume as a person, while you're learning digital marketing and on the day first you are clear about it, what am I supposed to do? Or what I am going to do if I am going to graduate from this institute and you're clear about it that I'm Kanchan, looking forward to get a job in Delhi, that too only in the agency world. So my focus is just to develop my portfolio around it. Now what that portfolio is, let's research. Now in the Delhi market, this is Google Keyword Planner. This helps you to identify number of people searching about keywords every month to identify the market size. So people living in Delhi and looking forward for digital marketing agency profile, what will they do? They will look forward for digital marketing agency in Delhi, right? Social media agency. We should also add Delhi here. Or social media agency. They will look forward for website designing company. I mean, there can be a lot of keywords, right? Now, just search for these four and understand. So the market size, digital marketing agency is in Delhi. That is around 1K to 10K and that the rest is like, let's say the overall market will be few in lakhs, few lakh people. This is what they're searching. I mean, these are the keywords only about Delhi. Now, Kanchan, what she is supposed to do, you develop one website or a blog which ranks various websites. You might have observed there are sites, those who talks about digital marketing courses, right? You might have seen those sites. They are talking about Pune, Delhi, Mumbai, every city. That's what I'm trying to relate. Those are listicle sites. They create articles and then they run ads and all that. Your objective is not this. Your objective is that you create a blog which only talks about agencies in Delhi only and Noida or Gurgaon. Now, out of 1 lakh search volume, you don't have to get 1 lakh people. Your target is only to get 5,000 people from 4 months onward. The month 4 onwards, you should go ahead and get 5,000 people every month at your blog. 
is this clear those who are interested to study about various agencies offering digital agency services now our industry says out of total traffic from a targeted audience we get 20% leads means 1000 people are leads for this business remember this thing those who are interested to go ahead and give you their phone number email id and name like you guys did at iim skills then our industry says if you have ever worked in a sales department organic leads has a minimum conversion rate of 10% or even if i'll take this hypothetically for 5% so out of 1000 leads 1k lead 50 people are buying from kanchan's blog every month or they are ready to buy she is not selling anything but she has ready to buy prospects which are like 50 people every month getting my point now what she has in this case understand 50 people with a budget of 10k at least bare minimum they will spend on their digital marketing 10000 rupees this is bare minimum baseline so i am saying she has 5 lakh revenue every month at her blog so calculate this like this way if someone will hire her or everybody would like to definitely he will hire her jan 2021 if she will go ahead and give them a 5 lakh rupee revenue with the help of leads february this revenue will be jan 5 lakh plus february new 5 lakh which will further grow so march it is already 10 lakh plus 5 lakh addition after a year or once she is next 2022 she will be at 60 lakh confirm or recurring revenue for this particular business and addition of new revenue are you able to do this calculation yourself or able to relate what i have just now done now the point is kanchan will be an asset why because this is b2b business she has already proved that whatever she is doing is driving results getting my point because she is capable enough to drive people at her own blog and then convert them into a lead or find things and the other people out there they can see that with the help of that url that is what she is going to get a breakthrough so now this creates a difference that instead of she asking for people to go ahead and get a job they would love to hire her is this point clear to all but this process takes a lot of time it is not that you are going to do this a learning and then you are going to hit in the market no this process is 3 months of a learning and then at least for the 4 to 5 months to invest in terms of every types of things so it's you can call it like 6 months to 8 months journey depending upon your hard work and then you are someone in the market and when i say someone it has a huge potential and instead of you requesting or adding your portfolios at various sites you don't have to like nokri and all you are job ready people will come to you that why don't you join us trust my words this is what you are going to do because it has a huge revenue potential was this clear to everybody i quick i need a quick yes no maybe from all in the chat box and then i'm going to pick the next topic so far this understanding is clear everybody wonderful i hope you liked it you understood each and every part around it okay so now let me go ahead and put some light that is around freelance so now freelance plus business i'm going to club these things together now those who are here to finally set up their business and those who are here to start with freelance i'm going to mix these two things now i have a question before i talk about freelancing as a career let's assume you guys have an opportunity to learn digital marketing course that is from an institute by the name of iim skills and then you have another option that is learning digital marketing that is from a, a instructor a freelance instructor that is webhub.com the ticket size the course delivery the certifications the modules everything is similar to each other there is no difference it is just like one is freelancer other one is iim skills which institute or which place will you prefer to learn your digital marketing course from do you think you will prefer iim skills or do you think you will prefer webhub.com as an individual in the chat box please apur will go with webhub harsh will go with iim anushka will prefer iim ashwini shubham will prefer iim 
Bhaskar will prefer, Pranay will prefer IM. Okay, a lot of you have said IM skills, right? Now let me go ahead and help you guys to understand one subject here. Out of 100 people, 95 people, they trust brands, okay? And five people, they trust freelancers, depending upon their budgets and all. Now, the point of view is when you are into a service-based industry, so see, job part is over. So those who will do their job, they are responsible to do one particular task in a day. But once you are into freelancing or your own business, you have to be the CEO. You, have, you must know how to do finance. You must know how to do sales. You must know how to do marketing. You must take care of delivery. You must go ahead and take care of your customer satisfaction. Reviews, rating, online reputation, and everything. You're, you're, you're one man army. Getting my point? You are not just responsible to just do one area. You have to sell, market, and do everything. Am I right? Am I making sense? Quick yes, no, maybe in the chat box. Now, my point is see, when you are putting best efforts like finance, sales, and everything, and there is a market, there is a market search volume and you are getting 100 leads. Why is that you will pick up five people who are interested to talk to you because you're a freelancer versus not 95? See, if I have a potential to sell to 95, is it a smart move to pick five? Answer is no. Correct? So what is this? I mean, what are you trying to create, Weber? Can you put some light? Yes. Now, my point of view is that, see, guys, it took me, trust me, it took me around few years and then a lot of hard works, not just mine. It's a collective hard work of everybody working at IM Skills to develop this institute wherever we are. And it's still, I think there is a huge space we can cover up. And it, that will further take five, 10 years from here. Getting my point? No, you cannot establish a brand all in quick seconds. It takes time, hard work. It takes your sweat. Is it good move? Answer is yes. Why? Because you get 95 people to sell versus five. So what you should do, my recommendation is in our program, what we always help people to understand is that you definitely start with freelance, but it should not be that long-term plan. If you remember the long-term vision with digital, your long-term plan should be that one way you're starting up with the freelance and another way you're, de you're developing your brand for an agency or anything, whatever you would like to pick up. Earn your bread and butter for next two years. That is through freelancing. And I'm sure you are not going to earn more amount here. It's going to be between 20,000 to 50,000 bucks only, depending upon the clients you're going to pick up. And your uh, you know leads buffer and all that. However, if you will establish your brand parallelly to this side that you're developing, let's say your product pages. Now your products are your services pages. You're focusing at ranking them through SEO, you are developing your various ranking. You're developing your social media fan following. You're also capturing emails, okay? And then you're conducting only free webinars just to create an awareness regarding this brand. You're inviting various industry leaders so that they can go ahead, help you to just, you know, uh, increase the word of mouth and all that. And once you are at a stable stage where you have captured, so you've started capturing 100 organic leads in a month, you're good to launch yourself in the market. Why I'm saying this? Because you don't need so many leads in this particular business model. 100 leads are more than enough. Even if you're going to convert 10% of it, you get 1 lakh rupee confirmed revenue. Making sense? And it's going to be confirmed forever. So if you see month on month, you will be at a stage where you have a confirmed recurring revenue of 25 lakh after a year or so. And even if you don't sell to a new client, you have 25 lakh rupee client with you. Those who are going to pay you if you serve them properly. Am I making sense? But the point is, I have a huge opportunity with 95 versus 5. Freelancing is not a good move when you're planning it. For a short term, it is good. But if you're planning it for a long term, it is not at all recommended. Now, when I talk about brand, okay, how I am skills or people like us helps. So what we do in our program, we actually go ahead and help you to understand and validate the idea. Sometimes what we do is that we know that whatever we are doing is best. It's not. We must go ahead and validate the idea. And if your idea is good, we will definitely go ahead and get into each and everything of that subject that how we can go ahead and increase the market potential, how we can go ahead and get into 
the world of digital, scale up your business, and then we will execute everything in the training. So it's going to be a long-term vision. It's not that it's in a month or so you're going to establish, but we will go ahead and set up each and everything that this is the plan for SEO, this is the plan for ads, this is the plan for social media, and focus and just keep repeating those things. The entire focus is declare that I need 10,000 people all around the keywords I am writing for or developing my website. Just for 10,000 people, recurring traffic every month at my site. And if that happens, you're good to launch yourself. Meanwhile, focus at freelancing too, to start earning at least so that you're earning your bread and butter. Am I making sense? <clears throat> this process takes time. However, it's not that easy to establish a brand. But once it is there, which is like right after one year, two years time, believe me, Ashwini, believe me, Prane, believe me, everyone else, you guys will never regret the hard work you've done. And it is not easy. It is not that game that a digital marketing course and a great career. Come out of this myth, everyone who promised that there was a salary hike given to our employees, all such things, almost marketing, almost paid PR. Whatever you see in the internet industry, first of all, remember one thing, wherever you're getting the most advertisement from, they are more aggressive to sell. All right, just remember this part because this is how industry is. I mean, in the education industry, when people talk about PR, when people talk about this, most of the stuff are made up. It's not true. All right. One thing which you will love about IM skills is that you may never see we are running an ad around anything. You might have observed that. Anyway, so let's talk about the next source of income, which one can go ahead and do. And I think this is again a uh, time consuming thing. But uh, it requires a lot of patience too. But once you are there, it is a good revenue source. It's by the name of affiliate marketing. I am sure you guys have heard about this subject. But again, uh, one poor part about affiliate marketing is a lot of people have diluted this industry as well by selling various types of affiliate marketing courses and promising people that you are going to become rich. It's absolutely not true again. Affiliate marketing requires a lot of time and patience. Of course, it's a collective team effort again. But let me ask you guys a question. Have you ever heard about this word, affiliate marketing? How many of you have heard about affiliate marketing in the past? Few people have, few people have not. Okay. No problem. I will go ahead and create. So uh, affiliate marketing stands for that uh, you're advertising for somebody else. So there are two ways to advertise. One is influencer marketing. Influencer marketing stands for, let's say you are at Instagram and let's say there is a girl, she has a lot of followers and then there is one makeup company. You might have seen uh, this girl without any verified profile and all she's advertising, adding so many videos and all such things, right? Now, this is called influencer marketing because you have a lot of followers, okay? Second is that affiliate marketing. Let's say you are a very good, uh, you are good in terms of content creation. You understand SEO, content writing, all those words, okay? And then uh, let's say someone is searching for iPhone 11 review, example. You are affiliated with Amazon and what you have done, you have given a link to Amazon that people can click and buy. And if, if they do, you get the money. Let's say if someone have clicked but have not bought the product, don't worry for next six months, the servers saves the cache. Okay, I mean, your browser saves the cache. So whenever this guy will buy at Amazon, you're likely to get the money and it will be counted at your sale. Let's invest and learn about this thing with an example. All right. So I'll go ahead and search for you guys here. So let's say best washing machine in India. Let's search for this. Now for you guys, what it is at the moment you may see that okay best washing machine in india let me go ahead and show you guys the search volume for this keyword only given okay, the tool is here it doesn't work in the incognito window in india 27100 people they search for best washing machine all right it is almost as uh, you know sized at your digital marketing institute uh, part what do you get bajaj finsurf amazon kitchen arena home lightness, energy conversion device, smart home guide, right? Now, wherever you see this 10 best, 11 best, 
nine best these words right now these are listicle articles majorly easy to rank at the search engines point one at the same time these are almost affiliated links so let's open this energy conversion device which is a simple blog around various products now if you look at it energy conversion device whirlpool 5 kg typically we will click at the first link only now can you guys see these if i click on any of these let's say any any of these let's say here or anywhere check sale price i will get 16499 i have liked this and i'll buy if i'm interested to you pay attention can you see this link tag is equal to ecd lav this is affiliated link whatever you see at the web is affiliated almost almost you see the top courses for digital marketing the first name which you're getting every time everywhere it's an affiliated link the other person is paying for it so let's say you have paid to someone for 60000 rupees to learn a course your 30000 goes to or 20000 goes to those affiliate marketers those who have helped those guys to convert you guys into a sale getting me now look at it it's so easy i mean if you look at it what are what are types of things these guys are writing look at it i mean top best clutches best you know watches for women sling bags and who these people are they are writing let's say these are three people reva ri and lavanya you know if you look at it how much traffic do they generate energy conversion devices at this particular website Three lakh thirty-two thousand one hundred six is the number of people they're driving at this site. This is hypothetical number. It can be way higher than this one. Three lakh thirty-two thousand. If you take even a one percent conversion, that people are clicking and buying, and they get two dollars per sale. It's like three lakh out of this three thousand three hundred people are clicking, and they are making around. Sixty-six hundred USD a month. Six thousand six hundred USD a month. So it's like INR to USD if you calculate just from a blog, right? If this is what they are actually capturing, it's like five lakh rupees just from one blog. Are they doing anything? No, they're just creating content. So when I search for, if you remember, iPhone eleven, did you guys see this GSM Arena? Now, what is GSM Arena? how do they make money do you remember this gsm arena site they write about all tech reviews remember now gsm arena is a site which talks about all the mobile phones electric devices and they write reviews give ratings and everything am i right now how do they make money this is one from google adsense they are running ads point number 1 what else i have just clicked at the review and i only check someone's review when i'm interested to buy for example you guys might have seen i am skills review too if you're interested to buy or considering us to learn digital marketing suddenly you found on the left hand side a lowest price you may likely to go ahead and click here am i right so if you will click here but you have not bought the product today this link got saved as the cache getting my point and then some day let's say even after a month you realized okay let's go ahead and buy this guy likely to get money this gsm arena now you for you this is this is going to be a question how much gsm arena is going to make out of this so actually if you check gsm arena as a traffic see it's a very very old site very old gsm arena receives 68.9 million people every month at their blog and they make huge money now a question that comes to everyone minds is that is it fruitable is it something can i go ahead and do it is possible but it requires a lot of time patience and energy to develop a channel for affiliate once it is there you are a winner in the game are you getting my point everybody once it is there you are going to scale up your career at a big time but it requires a lot of time patience and energy i've been an affiliate marketer i used to write and i mean i still run this site coachdeco.com i write various affiliate channels i run advisorandle.com now these are all affiliated link if we are selling something it is good if we are not selling something what we do we go ahead and we are affiliated with 
uh, Udemy, Coursera, ADX. So every link, if you see here, is again an affiliated link. We are running ads here, okay? Now the point is, uh, our metrics are different. We observe that which courses are sellable in the market and then our vision is to go ahead and develop our own self-learning channel, which is already there. I mean, if you check, we are developing another kind of Udemy site type of site, which is for self-learning courses. And uh, it's by the name of Idiot. And almost we will go ahead and plan around it. So what I'm trying to relate is that if you look at it, this channel, or I mean, it's not my effort at all now. There are team members who are writing each and everything. But uh, showing you guys an income around how much I still make from an affiliate is absolutely wrong. The reason being, there are a lot many people who are writing about stuff at IM Skills, and that's going to be a wrong figure if I'll set up for you guys. But if you have time, you're good in terms of content creation, and you are someone who can who, who can aim for two years plan like we do. In my case, I actually plan for long journeys. Okay, so if you are someone who can do this. Believe my words, affiliate marketing is something which will help you to have a recurring income of 20,000 at least in a month, but after two months onwards, and you must write one article a day and your niche should be good. I'll help you to validate that if you're here at Iron Skills, but it should be good. Now, given I was also on the, on the other side, I was talking about agency, right? So that's the other case. See, I mean, it's easy to say. We are also in a process of developing an agency so that... Uh, of course, not me. It's in a partnership with somebody. So it's already there. You can see it's similar website like this. So what are we doing? We have a different process. We're developing first our authority around a word called digital marketing agencies. That's why we are only writing listicle articles. Once these articles are here, we will go ahead and look forward to you know set up our web project product pages so that people can come, then they can apply, and then we can you know serve like this. So everything is going on. I mean, big processes are there. But what I'm trying to relate for everybody is that the market is huge. It's growing and it will further grow. No doubt around it. But remember one thing to everybody out there. Just remember it is a patience game. At the same time, you require a lot of time to invest, to study digital and execute digital, at least for the first one year. Once it is done, you are at a stage once you know that I am good at organic or I'm good at paid and then Pick that as a market and establish yourself big time. Is this clear to everybody? I need a quick yes, then I can talk a little bit about IM skills, what we do, and then we can go ahead, take your questions. I hope so far things are clear to everyone. Now let's understand why IM skills. See, unlike, so I, I'm not defaming anybody, and I'm not saying that everyone else is not doing good. Everybody is doing good. Uh, the only point of discussion is, uh, and again, as I said, no one will tell you the reality. The reality is this, whatever at IM skills we are offering, okay, and whatever people are offering in the market, it is all available free of cost at YouTube. That's it. Now, have you got this chance that anyone have said this to you clearly? Now, the point of view is, why am I saying this? And if everything is available free of cost at YouTube, then Webhub, why are we supposed to pay you the money? See, if I'm saying this, you download every website or every organization's brochure, go to YouTube, study or pick their topics one by one, and you're going to get everything available at YouTube. All you have to do is that just connect the dots and you're learning digital marketing for free. It takes time. Now, why is that am I paying Webber? Because you are not paying here for the content. You're paying only for one thing called mentor. So the point is you're going to learn digital marketing. And once you're going to execute digital marketing, whatever you're doing, whether it is right or wrong, that is where it makes a lot of difference. So as I said, at IM Skills, it's pure objective driven training. So if you're here to get a job, I'll help you to know where that job is. And then we will work about that job throughout this training. When you are here to set up your freelance or business, I will help you to identify on the day first that this is your business, my friend. Let's 
done this. Well, let's do this in the course itself. So there is nothing after the course, like every other place, it's in the course. You have me, you have other trainers, they are IITNs who are going to teach and we don't advertise on their face. We want people to buy iron skills so that people should know whatever they're doing in this training, they are meeting the right people and they are going to give them a great mentorship. You get trainer support throughout the course. So it's like a hand holding. If you are stuck, I am there. Over a call, Zoom, email. You get lifetime access to iron skills program. So now what is this course? Though I'm sure you guys might have seen, we do a co co you know content writing program. Uh, I'm sorry, we do a digital marketing program that's for 180 hours, which is divided into 60 hours of live lectures and 120 hours of assignments. It is for three months and there are 40 different topics of digital marketing. All right, if there is a certification preparation, you can appear for the test and the cost is available here, as you guys can see. These are the topics you're going to learn in depth. Now there are two ways to study. One way is that you can study over the Saturday batch that is, uh, starting from a day after tomorrow the another batch is weekdays batch both the batches are left i think this batch is full this batch is left with uh, four five seats you can accordingly see i'll uh, i need to check that part and uh, there are classes which we conduct saturday 10 to 1 and weekday tuesday thursday 8 to 9 30 along with this no matter you are in saturday classes or you are in tuesday thursday classes there are special topics which we conduct on Wednesday and Friday, that is 8 p.m. to 9 p.m. And for both the classes, this is a mixed class. 8 to 9, Wednesday, Friday. All right. And uh, the assignment part is all there. Please have already discussed. Now, before I take your questions, I wanted to give you guys a New Year gift, which we usually don't do. So in the internet industry, I am sure you guys are aware about the fact that uh, content is the king and we are the player around content writing just to inform you can research so we run a content writing program that is for a month okay and there are various types of content creation which we teach 25 different types of it these are all those topics it's a one month course that costs people 11900 plus taxes okay and it's a 16 hours of a training, 60 hours of live assignment. So it's a separate one month training, which happens on Sunday, 10 to 2. So those who will actually go ahead and take IM Skills Digital Marketing Program until 5 p.m. today, this link which I'm sharing is only for those. Okay. So people who will register accordingly with the help of this URL, not at the website URL, the URL given by me, which is valid until 5 p.m no matter for the weekday batch or the weekend batch, will get a complimentary course for content writing. And this we only give to first three people. All right. So three people, whoever will be the first will get it. Complimentary access to our one month content writing master course. And believe me, without content. So in our main program, we teach content writing, but we don't teach how to write ebook, how to do copywriting how to go ahead and do business listing, commercial page writing, all such things we are going to cover up in this program. Is this clear? Now, this is what I was supposed to go ahead and discuss. Now, the next thing is that you guys can go ahead and ask me questions around anything or everything, whatever you would like to. I would not like to pitch more. So remember, until 5 p.m., this link is valid. You can go ahead and explore. Now you can ask questions around anything. I'm there to answer. Shubham, black hat also, which you're talking about. Someone who says that I'm teaching you black hat, just remember, okay. Would you like to do anything illegal? Let me ask you guys this question. First of all, Shubham, to you. Kya aap kuch bhi illegal karna ho? Answer is no. There is a webmaster guideline, right? I'll explain Shubham. Aapko samajna hoga. 
see as i said internet pay you have a lot of content lot of people are promising lot of things okay because their final objective is to sell you so when you are going to take let's say a server so there will be a ip aapki ip jo hogi wo shared ip hogi okay shared ka matlab ye hai ki aapke ip pe 1000 aur log honge jo us ip ko use kar rahe honge any of these guys whoever have done even black hat and they so what google penalized not just your domain name wo ip ko bhi bad reputation mark karta hai kisi aur ne bhi kara aur aapki ip reputation mark ho gayi आपकी लाइफ के अंदर जितने भी आप इंटरनेट बेस्ड बिजनेसेस करोगे वो सब फ्लॉप हो जाएंगे इज दिस क्लियर ब्लैक हेड इज सिंपल नो सो वट आई एम ट्राइंग टू रिलेट दिस इज वॉट इट इज आई मीन पीपल हैव नो क्लू दे आर जस्ट राइटिंग स्टफ एट द इंटरनेट एंड सेलिंग दैट्स द मोस्ट इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट राइट यू मस्ट नो वट आर यू डूइंग यू मस्ट नो वाई इट इज इंपॉर्टेंट एंड देन अकॉर्डिंगली यू एग्जीक्यूट योर डिजिटल मार्केटिंग थिंग the career is good from here for digital marketing and this will further grow no doubt around it anyone else would like to go here and ask question shubham says that okay so we have Darshan, is this for people who just want to join job in a shortest time possible after completing the course? Darshan, it is definitely possible, no doubt around it. It is just like that. You have to invest more hard work in terms of developing your good portfolio profile. Shivam says, if I go with this weekdays batch, do I get recorded lecture to see if I can attend live lectures? What will be the timing if it is a live lecture? Shubham, you will get recording whether you attend or you do not attend. That is for lifetime. Class time is Tuesday, Thursday, eight to nine thirty. Wednesday, Friday, eight to nine. Remember one thing, Shubham. You can repeat. You can do our course hundred times. There is no extra charge. Even if you miss a class, you can repeat the same one. Can we learn through trial and error? Practicing digital marketing on a website for a non-person, maybe. Yes, Apoor, you can without a problem. Pranay says, after the course completion, the certificate will be from any university, or it is anonymous type. Okay, autonomous. Sorry. Uh, the point is, you are going to get a certificate offered by Google, Facebook, HubSpot, and IM Skills. All are validated in the industry, and at the same time, you see everywhere, given they are the authorities, their certifications are globally recognized, except for China. Shubham says everyone is promising for job assistance. No one is promising for hundred percent job placement. Is there is any live project and assignment in IM Skills? We do give assignment, but you are going to work upon your own assignments in this course. That is point number one. Those who are not promising you job placement, believe them. Those who are giving you hundred percent job placement, don't believe them. Shubham, remember when you are let's say you are running a marathon. It is you who can control your marathon speed, right? similarly when you are in an interview no one can take care of your interview what are you talking about what are you saying what are you answering it's all in your hand am i right no one can control the interview part so these are good people who are telling you that okay we are only giving you assistance can we request you can we request or ask your you questions pertaining of my business for suggestion why not offline i mean at uh, over a call we can go ahead and speak ashwini you can ask my colleague vinay for my number if we buy the digital marketing course now do we have to attend the content writing course and uh, we can have this course after digital marketing no no harsh your content course will anyways uh, start after one month or one and a half so you should not go ahead and learn everything uh, in one go else you will be confused and overloaded with the uh, what do we say assignments what course do still we get an assistance for suggestion query after course do still we get yeah lifetime don't worry there is no problem at all vaskar 
does any coding knowledge is required for any any field in digital marketing also even at the advanced level first there is no basic and there is no advanced okay and uh, one thing i wanted to tell you that uh, apurv there is no such coding skills are required there are some cases when you may need a little help around your wordpress website so for that we have a team member solving those anushka says will there be any other batch in the feb or march anushka honestly at the moment no idea but we will surely update you if you're not planning at this moment thank you so much uh, ashwini sunday batches we do not have sunday live batches my friend at the moment because uh, only the saturday and weekdays one are available uh for harsh when is this is going to hand you are planning about which uh, weekdays or weekend i can give you the exact date weekend cool night it will start one second this will end on th 13th of march 13th march if i only go for digital marketing course there will be no content course included in digital marketing right uh, it's anyways complimentary shubham so yeah you have a choice there is a content writing program which we teach but in that we only teach how to write content for articles and blogs but in the content industry there is a lot more commercial pages ads copy copywriting social media storytelling ebooks white papers research papers instructional designing and a lot more around that so overall your writing skills will improve and you will get in depth of the uh, writing part it's very critical okay those who have a plan for the upcoming batch so that i should not forget the link is again available here what time do you suggest given i have a job from 4 pm to 12 pm is it 4 am my friend or pm ankit how is it okay oh i see uh you can take our saturday as a batch there is no problem then the one which you are talking about the uh wednesday friday classes ankit do not worry uh, we will get you those classes as well uh, either you will get the recording and that's anyways for 8 hours overall 8 classes will happen for to in total even either we will get you the recording otherwise once if if we ever do that over the weekend part you can join those on saturday there is no problem your main lectures the important hands on lectures we are going to conduct over saturday only any other question which you would like to go ahead and ask guys even i am doing a part time job but there is that is in the morning so i can i can attend the lecture in the evening yes of course why not yashmin can a person manage both the roles content writer and digital marketer won't it be hectic uh, it's impossible yashmin that people can or person can manage both uh, you cannot that's the reality but without content or understanding about overall content creation about all the channels you can never become a good digital marketer this is also important so remember one thing when you are writing see you know how to run an ad but if you are not good with ads copy there is a challenge getting my point yasmin so remember creation of what to write in that content copy is very critical to even finally do those ad parts on all those things Shubham says, "I am MBA fresher, graduate, done MBA two years ago. Am I eligible, Shubham? 
without a doubt, yes, you are. There is no problem at all. I think, in fact, profile IQ is more good in terms of uh, getting good outcome in the digital. Then I have Prane. What about if I'm planning for only one aspect instead of learning complete DM course? Definitely up to you, Prane. However, uh, you must you must know. Let's assume. Uh, okay, let's say SEO. All right. Now, if you understand broadly SEO as a term, content is the king. Okay. Similarly, when you're talking about Google ads. So to run Google ad, you must understand not just ads part, a little bit of graphics, a little bit of copywriting, a little bit of WordPress and landing pages. You must understand. So somewhat everything is interconnected. Okay. But if you're going to work for a department or any organization, it's easy because they have team members for every task to execute. However, I personally feel those who always get a growth in their life, they are multitasker. I mean, they have a lot of, or they have knowledge about almost everything. Okay. Now depends which type of an organization you are joining. However, one topic, is not at all a bad area to establish yourself. However, there is a limited growth versus you are aware about all the facts. So decide accordingly. Her says how many students are in the weekdays batches? Each batch will have 30 students. Weekday will have less, 15 to 20, Harsh. Typically people do weekday batches less in comparison to the weekend one. Can I join? the institute in coming week are the batches available sir uh, shubham if you know my colleague uh, vinay he is the person who can guide you because we never launch batches like that based on the participation we actually go ahead and announce the dates and vinay is the right person because he is the final resource for us as well who inform us that okay we need batch on this day so i think he's the right person to coach and guide around that Darshan says, I'm pursuing graduation BCA and looking for a job as soon as possible. Is this for me? Uh, Darshan, let me first of all be very honest. Uh, if you're looking forward to get a job, again, okay, that to any job, first get a job. Please, first get a job. And if you're looking forward to learn digital marketing and then get a job in digital marketing, my friend, I'll be honest, I would need time. Because it's not that I'll promise you to get your 29,900 right now and then you are further in a trap. No, I don't want to do that. See, remember, if it is a job, get a job and learn digital marketing. There is no better career than this. I can assure you this thing, but it requires a time. I do not know what's your learning pace. You may be a really quick learner and you can be a really, really poor learner. I really don't know about that. So I cannot judge you at this moment, my friend. Okay. So remember one part that uh, it will take time to learn digital and execute, but it is promising industry. Ashwini says, if in case I want to attend the live classes again after a year or so, you have a lifetime access, Ashwini. Just mail us, info at ironskills.com, would like to repeat, that's it. You will get into the class. Can you brief me more about career growth in this field? Shubham, can I do it offline given orientation I've already extended by 10 minutes? I, you can take my number from my colleague. We can speak. Wonderful. Okay, before you guys leave this orientation, I have a request in the chat box. If you can please leave your feedback for the day. How is your experience with me? Overall, uh, my colleague Vinay will give you Shubham. Overall, how was it from the understanding point of view? So if you can just put some light, Ankit, Anushka, Ashwini, Bhaskar, Darshan, Harsh, Kanchan, Pranay, Rohit, Shubham, Yamin, Yasmin, I'm sorry, and someone using Babu Lambert. Thank you, Anushka. Thank you, Ankit. Hope you guys liked it. Thank you, Kanchan. Thank you, Harsh. Thank you, Darshan. Glad you liked it. Thank you, Yasmin. Thank you, Shubham. Thank you, Ashwini and everyone.
Great, everybody. Great. Looking forward. So for any help, you can get in touch with my colleague, Vinay. Uh, he's a guy who's working uh, in the digital industry since last eight years. So he has a good knowledge about the subject. Believe me, he's not just counseling people. He understands digital as a subject very well. If you further need help, you can ask for my number. Just fix up a call with me and we can discuss. I'm always available to coach, guide. Remember one thing, the objective is not to sell you at all. See, in the end of the day, of course, I'm also running a business. I need bread and butter. Everybody needs that. But I would definitely like to go ahead and always keep ethics first before the business. At the same time, we are in a kind of business model where people expect a lot from us. And if our expectations do not you know, match with each and everybody, I never go ahead and ask people to join. So remember one thing, it's I am skills. You're joining the trusted people if you're planning to, and we will do wonders together. Your hard work, my coaching, and everything will be there in the program. So now, guys, allow me to say goodbye. Happy New Year to all. And uh, for any help, please connect with Mr. Vinay. Okay? So it's time to say goodbye. And I will also upload the recording part of this orientation so that you guys can check at our YouTube channel. Once again, have a good day. Have a good time. Thank you so much for joining us. And for those who are planning to take up the upcoming batch, link is there. You can enroll. Just do not forget, uh, the until 5, you guys have a content program available with the help of this link. See you guys. Happy New Year. Take care.